Today, we will explore three key aspects that every NVIDIA stockholder should be aware of. First, we will examine NVIDIA's growing investment in research and development R&D to meet increasing customer demand. Next, we will discuss NVIDIA's recent dividend hike and the potential for future increases. Finally, we will delve into NVIDIA's stock repurchase program and why investors can expect more buybacks in the future. Let's get started. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Daily Stock Update. If you are new to the channel, be sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications by hitting the bell so you never miss any of our uploads and also enter our giveaway. But before that, alert, this is not a financial advice video. Over the past few years, NVIDIA has significantly ramped up its R&D spending. In the three months ending April 28th, NVIDIA allocated $2.72 billion to R&D. This figure represents 10.4% of their revenue, a decrease from the 26% of revenue spent in the same quarter of the previous year. Despite this percentage drop, the actual R&D expenditure rose by 45% climbing from $1.875 billion to $2.72 billion year over year. This decrease in R&D as a percentage of revenue is not indicative of reduced effort, but rather a reflection of NVIDIA's soaring revenues. The company aims to keep R&D spending as a stable percentage of revenue. However, the rapid revenue growth has made it challenging to maintain this balance. Scaling up R&D expenditure to match the revenue increase would be inefficient requiring significant additional resources, including personnel and infrastructure. For the fiscal year 2025, NVIDIA expects operating expenses to grow in the low 40% range, contrasting sharply with the anticipated revenue growth of over 100%. This robust growth outlook underscores the importance of continued investment in R&D. Although I do not own NVIDIA stock, I strongly recommend it as one of the top stocks to buy this year. If I were a shareholder, I would advocate for increased R&D spending, given NVIDIA's track record of generating positive returns from these investments. Management has indicated that the R&D spending increase is directed towards employee growth, compensation, and substantial investments in computing and infrastructure. As NVIDIA continues to develop innovative products and services, attracting and retaining top talent is crucial. Expanding the workforce with skilled engineers and developers is essential for sustaining NVIDIA's competitive edge. The second focus of our analysis is NVIDIA's dividend increase. A key factor to consider here is NVIDIA's remarkable increase in cash flow from operations, which surged more than fivefold to $15.345 billion, up from $2.9 billion year over year. This substantial growth in cash flow provides NVIDIA with ample financial flexibility to reward shareholders through dividends and stock buybacks. On May 22, NVIDIA announced a significant 150% increase in their quarterly cash dividend, raising it from $0.04 cents to $0.10 cents per share. Companies are typically cautious about raising dividends, as dividends are viewed by investors as long-term commitments. When a company initiates or increases a dividend, investors expect this payment to be sustained or even increased over the years. Therefore, a cut or pause in dividends can trigger a negative reaction from investors, often resulting in a drop in the company's stock price. NVIDIA's substantial dividend hike signals strong confidence in its long-term financial health and prospects. By committing to higher dividends, NVIDIA demonstrates its ability to generate consistent and growing cash flows, which is a positive sign for current and potential investors. Lastly, let's discuss NVIDIA's stock repurchase activities. During the first quarter of fiscal 2025, NVIDIA repurchased 9.9 .9 million shares of its stock for $8 billion. As of April 28, 2024, the company is authorized to buy back up to an additional $14.5 billion worth of common stock. The primary goal of this repurchase program is to offset dilution from shares issued to employees. Between April 29th and May 24th, NVIDIA repurchased another 2.3 million shares, spending $2.1 billion in just one month. This aggressive buyback strategy is likely to continue, driven by the company's robust cash flow from operations. Share buybacks reduce the total number of outstanding shares, which increases the earnings per share apps by distributing the net income across fewer shares. 
by reducing the share count, NVIDIA enhances shareholder value and signals confidence in its future performance. This approach, combined with the increased dividend, reflects NVIDIA's commitment to returning capital to shareholders and sustaining long-term growth. In summary, NVIDIA's proactive approach in increasing R&D spending, boosting dividends, and executing significant stock buybacks are key indicators of the company's robust financial health and growth potential. These strategies not only support NVIDIA's innovation and market leadership, but also enhance shareholder value through consistent returns. Investors should closely monitor these developments as they provide valuable insights into NVIDIA's strategic priorities and long-term prospects. By understanding these aspects, NVIDIA stockholders can make more informed decisions and align their investment strategies with the company's growth trajectory. Friends, that's all we have for you today. What is your opinion about today's video? Get involved and let us know in the comments down below. Thanks for watching.